Actually, I think we have another shot coming in now, so we're gonna find out if this works. Please, 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 please work. It's a moment of hope. Oh, here we go. Hello, guys. How's it going? And a welcome back to another episode of Factions. I believe, I'm probably gonna get this wrong, but I'm gonna take a guess. Maybe I'll be close. I believe we're on 833 episodes of Faction now. We're kind of already, I know we haven't got to 850 yet, but we're getting close to 900. It is creeping up. My only thing is, what's gonna happen when I hit 1,000 episodes? Am I gonna keep going? Am I gonna restart the show? Am I gonna move on? What's gonna happen, dude? I don't know, but it's exciting. <laughs> But anyway, guys, welcome back to Factions. If you enjoyed the show, you wanted to continue, go down below, smash that like button. That would be greatly appreciated. And I just want to answer a little question that I've been seeing in the comment section for a little while now. And I just want to put your mind at ease, hopefully. As you guys know, if you're involved, if you watch a lot of Minecraft YouTubers, you will notice that they have switched games or potentially even quit. Because even they're not just feeling the game anymore, they're bored of it or other personal reasons. But you would, you would have noticed that a lot of YouTubers or Minecraft YouTubers have quit or moved on to a different game. I'm here just to settle one thing, and that is I have no plans on quitting or leaving anytime soon. I, for one, still enjoy Minecraft. Minecraft is a very, very good platform for making unique shows like Hide or Hunt, making like modded factions for factions in general. I, for one, still enjoy Minecraft. That does not mean I play Minecraft all day, every day. I do. But I also play other games too. I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna take some shots here. Minecraft could have been a much better game if Mojang or Microsoft, whoever runs it nowadays, actually listened to the server community and the Minecraft community and just our little community and stuff as well. Because if you take a look at most servers, they're running four year old tech, which is like 1.8. Most of them are either running 1.8 or 1.7. Maybe I'll save that for another video, but like, it's like they don't listen to us. But we'll stop that negativity. I just wanted to get that little rant out there. But anyway guys, welcome back to Factions. Today, we are going to be doing a raid with Sharsi and Philip and this is a prime example, I'm not going to spoil it, but this is a prime example how a potential raid can go horribly wrong just like that. Now, did it go horribly wrong? You guys will have to find out, but it can happen. So be careful what you raid. But before we get into this episode, guys, we are going to open up our mystical charm. We have two more of these bad boys left. And hopefully we get another delivery soon from Mad, because I need one. And I kind of want Enchanted Charms, but I also want Mysticals. I can't really make up my mind, to be honest. Oh, I also, I also have a Necrotic Charm. Okay, right, let's do this. Let's go with the Necrotic Charm first, and then the Good Charm, which is the Mystical, of course. Let's roll this. I see something on the bonus reward, which I think is just 5,000 extra cash. Or is it 50k? Oh, no, it's 10k. Oh! Okay, well, we got the bonus reward of 10k. We also got um, Protection 3 and TNT. The Protection 3 I don't need. The TNT I guess I need. It's only one stack. I'll keep it. But the Prot 3, meh. <laughs> but here is the good charm. This is the one that can give you the almighty anarchist. Let's pop this open and let's just roll it. We're going to take a different approach today and we're just going to roll it. All of them at the same time and see if we get something good. Now, I see a lot of money. I see, we, well, we definitely 100% just got two fortune essence, which are really good because if we don't use all of them, we can sell those bad boys for a lot of money in the near future when people start to fortify their mask a bit more. And we also got, bam, 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 pig zombie spawner. Would have been better if it was creeper, but I can still sell that for money. But I think I'm, I'm actually, I keep saying that I'm going to sell these spawners for money, but I'm actually hanging on to them because I know soon enough, if I sell these for money right now, I'm going to end up buying them back because I'm going to be level 19 in the future and I'm probably going to be looking for heads. So I'm actually kind of keeping them. So I'm kind of lying to you guys that I'm selling them. But anyway, guys, enjoy today's raid. Tomorrow's video, guys, is going to be an amazing raid. Like, I'm saying that because I've, it's already actually recorded. It's going to be amazing. But anyway, guys, enjoy today's raid. Okay, so today, Sharsi, Philip, and I are doing a $33 million raid with only six walls. You heard correctly. This base has $33 million inside it. We th well, in spawners anyway. And they only have six walls. Yes, 
six walls. That's an insane amount of value built up for a six wall base. Hey, I'm not gonna judge too much. Maybe they got recently raided in their god base and they moved everything into this new base. But if we get everything inside here, if we get like some of the spawners and stuff, we will be so good. Like for a six wall base, anything we get, if we get like spawners, there's zombie spawners, there's mushrooms. If we can even get the zombies, that will be amazing. Now the faction is called Expanse All. They're worth, oh sorry, they're not worth 33 million. They're worth 32 million. They have one enemy, and that's screen time, <laughs> and none of them are online. But that's because this is an alt faction. The faction that they belong to is just called The Expanse, which has four of them online, but no one that we know is inside the base. So I think we might be good. But if this faction do catch us, there's four of them online, we can probably expect them to put up a decent fight. All we really have to do is get into the base before they like spot us. Like if we get into the base, then we can raid from there. But if they find us before we get in the base, then they can just patch it up and stop us so easily. Because all you gotta do is pearl over to the cannon and just seg it. I guess it's kind of my job to stop that from happening. So maybe I should go up to the top and just make sure. So as you can see here, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six walls. I just hope we get in because this will be a good raid if we do. From what I see, no one's inside the base. So we're good at the moment. As long as no one checks in it, we're really good. Oh my god, whatever way I looked at the cannon there, it looked like it blew up, but it didn't. It, it did. Really I, I, that's what looked at me as well. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did it? No, I thought it blew it, up though. It looked really it weird. No, I just saw like explosions all over the place. It looked really <laughs> weird. Shame. That scared me so much. <laughs> okay, one, two, three walls to go. Is my that like, um, is that that type of sand or that sand plate where one of them goes down fully and then the other yeah, one only loses one? Yeah, yeah. one of them, it's like a yeah, one shot. Yeah. It's like um, <laughs> oh, Adam's old cannon no. that you used to use. It's like your 40 stack at all. Yeah. Oh my god, I haven't used the 40 stacker in forever. I can when we try to use it for a raid. Yeah, you said you hated it. <laughs> or was that myth? Was I can't remember. Everyone, oh, like, remember everyone gives out about a cannon, but it does the job. It gets you into the base. Gets remember that raid me. when we raided, uh, well, when we were trying to raid them with TPG at all. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, actually, I need to speak to you guys about that. <laughs> that was, we knew what was going down that, well, actually, no, we, did, we didn't plan it, and then we were like, oh. Well, like, because TG, TG wanted to raid that base, back in that. By the way, just to explain to the viewers, basically, if you don't know, Sharcy, Philip, and I have some history, to put it that way, like, enemy-wise. Uh, we're good friends now, you know, we're raiding together in perfect harmony. But, um, yeah, no, that day, TG wanted to raid, and then you found TG, like, straight away, and then... TG sent me a message, oh, they're willing to cooperate with me. And I remember saying in the Discord chat, I said, like, yeah, they're not. <laughs> but I said, give it a try because you never know. And uh, the second I saw kind of something going on, I was like, hmm, okay, yeah, someone's definitely here. So then we waited for ages, waiting to see if we can just spot J Tom so we can just kill him straight away. Because we want to let you guys know that we knew. I don't know. Good times. That was fun. I remember just hiding up in a little box because there was just so many of you guys and so little of us. <laughs> yeah, we're in. Like this, I believe this is definitely. Yeah, but we're in. Hundred percent. Um, is there like spawners right by the wall that we're aiming for? Because I didn't split those inside the box. Or is, that, box here? is that a player box or a, like? Do you think we should loot a bit before we shoot? Yeah, I think we. Players? I think what I usually do is if we have the luxury of it, I would loot as much as I want. Oh, yeah, dude, yes, these chests yeah. are unnaturally empty. Never mind. Okay, we've got um trenchy TNT. Yeah, I would loot, and then I would, like, go for, like, the rest. But that's if we have the luxury. So just be ready if they do come, like, to be ready. Like, it's a bit of P4, fast. yeah. Oh, look in this chest here. Yeah, there's P4. Oh, it's just a like Dude, there's loads and loads of heads here, which I wouldn't mind. Oh, more trenchy TNT. Why'd they do that? Such a troll. So we're currently inside the base right now. We are thinking of just raiding the stuff out of the chest, then getting into the regens and mining the spawners and stuff. But there's so many chests here. Now, there's not amazing stuff there is tnt but as you can see it's not real tnt it's trenchy tnt wait is this person just came here wait who has he been here for a while no i didn't He's see like in a box i didn't see any oh, yeah, oh yeah. that's his ult i didn't yeah, see any names there are ults but i was at the opposite side of the base so wait i swear you just jumped there or yeah somewhere. do you guys want to just go for the spawners that's the main important thing that's that's the cash right there yeah that's hash bet because chess we can raid anytime thinking about it just get ready to catch the spawners I, no 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 these ults are coming online these were not here a second ago yeah i know they're all logging on that means that the owners probably come on down in a second wait, wait are they get ready to catch the spawners get ready to catch spawners yeah i'm ready just just go for it we'll just do as much as we can right now GG. Oh, did you get him 
Oh my no. god, that absolutely destroyed the base. Uh, where are they gone? Okay, let me set a home up here and I'll jump down after them. We might have blown them up if you have too much um, scatter on. Scott. Oh, I see them. They're down. They're down in the wall. Oh, okay. Right. Well, I pearl down, so just stay right there so they stay lower. No, they just disappeared. No, dude. Clear, are you serious? Yeah, oh, they lag. No, dude. Oh my god. That's so unlucky. And my pearl's going down there and everything. Rip. Okay, well, at least we'll be ready for the next one. Oh, there's squid heads. What do I need? I need. Oh, is there any endomites here? Actually, that's what I need. Wait, I'm pretty sure I've seen endomite heads up top. We might have blown. Yeah. yeah oh, oh, wait. We didn't raid this part, did we? You can take that wall of armor if you want it. Okay, should we just keep firing? And this time we'll be ready to catch him even better. <laughs> At least then clear lag won't be for a while. Okay, right. So I'm just trying to see if I can find any endomite heads here because that's exactly what I need to actually level up. But I don't think there is. Unless there's some hiding in the chest here. But I'm so salty. I wanted to get those squid spawners. If my pearl was just a little bit quicker or if there was no water, I could have jumped down and got them. No problemo. But anyway, look, you can't raid everything. And I guess it's gone from the enemy. So no one has them now. <laughs> oh, I've got the cheapest one. Oh, these are zombies right here that were lined up with as well. Uh, yep. Okay, right. Well, we'll hope if we get those, they're better than the squid. So let's just hope that we get those. Well, I think we need to stack stand, so I'll come back and stuff. Yeah, okay. I'll keep it. I'll let you know if anyone comes here. Okay, right. So while they're stacking stand to get into the regions here, and then the squids, or not the squids, but the zombies behind it, I'm just going to see if there's a cauldron here. There is, that I can deposit these mushroom heads in, because I am trying to make a mushroom mask. I have 15,000 heads saved up, but I'm definitely going to need a little bit more to actually be able to reinforce it, which is the main thing, because I can't use the mushroom mask before it's reinforced. Whoops. Sorry. <laughs> no, it's alright. <laughs> I guess there goes the heads. <laughs> alright, so we're about to break into the regions. Oh, dude, please say these regions are filled with stuff. If they are, this will be good. Regions are always exciting to raid. Does that, that work? Oh, no, we're clipping. Oh, no. No, no, no. No, dude, the raid can't end like this. Okay, so we're currently having a few issues with the cannon. It's, it's clipping on this block right here. We need to bust it open now. But we're restacking the sand and we're hoping that it's going to destroy this. It shouldn't be an issue. Not with this cannon anyway. But I think it was because the, there was loads of cactus down below. Which was like breaking the sand and making it very awkward. But now the cactus has been completely destroyed. I'm just double checking to see if there's anything here in this base that we should be taking. Like yeah there's prop 3. I don't need it as much. I don't need prop 4 as much anymore. I want to know what's going to be in these regens though as well. But I think that's like it. I think the only thing left really in this raid is break into the regens and get these zombie spawners. We need... Some sort of spawners from this raid. Because that's the main money there. Okay. Fingers crossed. I think we're about to shoot. Please say it fixes it. Oh. Okie dokie. That did nothing. This ain't good. This ain't good at all. <laughs> so while they are trying to fix that issue, there is an absolute ton of zombie heads right here. Which I should definitely be taking because I will need those. And I should be sticking them in my base. So I'm going to nab these really quickly because these are quite valuable. And there's like three dubs of them nearly. So I'm taking them. Oh, a shot's been fired. Did it work? Please say it did. Did it work? If not, I don't know if we'll be continuing this raid or not. Oh, wait. I think it worked. I can't tell. Oh, no, it didn't. Oh, ripperoni pepperonis. Okay, so that worked a little bit. Now, it's not fully done. So what we did was we disabled the scatter so that the sand wasn't nuked completely down. And now... We're going to enable the scatter, so hopefully then it will blow up this block, please. Sorry, I get very frustrated by these kind of things. It's this, oh look, this nasty little block. I bet you any money, if we don't get in, the faction what the faction who own this base, if they're watching this video, they're like this, this little block will have a shrine. It will, it definitely will. Because it could have just saved them a lot. Because we don't know, there could be like creeper spawners sitting in the region. No, actually there isn't because we've already looked to see if there was. As in, you can see what spawners they have stored and stuff. But we could do this. Just gonna take a bit of time. Actually, I think we have another shot coming in now. So we're gonna find out if this works. Please. Please, please, please work. It's a moment of hope. Oh, here we go. Yes, let's go, dude. Let's go. Finally. Okay, so good news. We got through the block. Now we can actually find out what's inside these regions. I'm gonna laugh. I'm actually gonna laugh if there's nothing inside here. Okie dokie, I'm a little bit laggy. Oh no. Well, I didn't think that was there. Got burnt. Um, now let's have a cheeky check. Oh dude, there's only two chests left. I we did blew you see literally all the chests up. Yeah, I, I know. Seen, like armor drop. Oh, yeah, you didn't see TNT. Oh or my god, this might have been rich. 
Oh my god, this might have been rich. Why, why, why? Why? Oh, oh my god, look in that tub. Look in that tub. I look didn't, in that tub. I think this was the only one with spawners in it. I only saw like a maybe prop four. I didn't see spawners. Spawners yeah, you would definitely see. Well, this was oh, definitely man, worth it. Nabbit, the slime, the... Oh, we got... Way, we got squid. We didn't lose them all. <laughs> Horses. Where will, oh, I, where will I store this, guys? Because I don't want to nab it all. Like, I won't use it anyway as much. As you guys would. Well, I just take yeah, it for now. You have that. You have that home inside my base, don't you? That unclaimed one. So you can nab it out of there uh, in a second. Not yet. I can get Oof. you there. I just saw prop four. I. You definitely would have seen spawners, hundred percent, if they were burning, because they yeah. they bounce around the place like crazy. GG. Okay. Well, that was definitely worth it, hundred percent. Just thank the Lord that we cannoned in that side instead of this side. If you yeah. know what I mean. Otherwise, it would have all went. Oh, by the way, if you see any obsidian, definitely take it. We're gonna need all of it, all the obsidian you can get. Right. So now I'm assuming we're going through these and then Wait, look. into the. Yes, we going. Look, don't need these regions. Oh, we got. Oh, dude, we nuked these as well. Yeah, I'll fireball. Yeah, yeah, I'm, my fireball isn't killed. Oh my god, no way. Well, I don't think, is there anything here? No, empty, empty. Oh, yay! TNT! <laughs> That's so not, it, no, it was a line of TNT. <laughs> I guess it was worth it. <laughs> Wait, we can still shoot again and try to get the zombies. Yeah, just oh, make sure you disable the scatter for the zombies because we don't want to make like a massive hole and then fall down into the cactus, you know what I mean? And it's dry as well, so remember that. We don't need sand. Uh, I'm uh, yeah, I'm that actually worked. Yeah, that did. The only thing is... Ooh, can you... Uh, I just have a look. You might be able to fire dry again, I think. I I'm actually, I, I didn't expect that to actually work. But I'm not going to lie. Keep me, keep yeah. me. I'll have a look. Do you know how many chunk info? How many zombies are actually here? There are five. So if we can get five of those, that'd be pretty decent. The thing is, though, there's some zombies here. Oh, is there? We're not going to get those, yeah, so though. So there might only be one here. Oh, I get what you mean. Yeah, I would say there's probably one in here and then like the rest are in there because this one's not where that one is. You surely protect the one with the most in it. This actually, if we're lucky... Oh, no, I was going to say... No, that's too far. I was going to say if we're lucky, it could actually blow up the spawners, but we're, no. Wait. Right. We're kind of close. Dry shot. Just disable scatter. Don't forget. <laughs> we don't Wait, want this... the same thing happening. Huh? Oh, I was just seeing if like somehow we've went down and got anything else. No, no, we haven't. No, I've already looted all those chests down there. Those ones were empty, but they had like there was like dubs of um zombie inside there. Get Actually, ready. I'm just gonna stand right here and yeah, I think I saw four. I think I saw four zombies. Do you get them? Uh, no. Uh oh, there they are. Three, 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 right here. Nabbed them. Got them. GG. Right there we go. Sorry, I thought I saw four, but it's obviously three. Woo! Sorry. I thought that for a second you just bust into another um, spawner down below, but it's just this one. I got disorientated. Right, well, there we go. G freaking G. That one obsidian block nearly ruined the raid, but no block ain't good enough for us. Okay, do you want to take another look at these uh, mushrooms and make sure? Because, like, I looked at them, you probably... Oh, hang on. Hello. Maybe the silverfish might be possible? I just don't know where exactly they're stored. If you come up the stairs here, you'll see why. Well, they're definitely not that active. They just came online when we got into the base, so they didn't realize we were actually raiding them. So they're definitely console clients. Um, I'm just going to stay here. Hang on. I don't know. Hmm. No, I don't know. See, like, there's a box up here, and it's, like, weirdly shaped. But I think it has, two, it has rabbits and silverfish. But the thing is, they're still in a square, so it won't work. Wait, let's just split the base. Yep, yeah, fully split the base, then we're done. I've checked all the chests. That's literally, this is everything in the base that we can get, anyway. Well, it's satisfactory. There we go. Fully split. Bloody so awesome we're only you. leaving them with mushrooms, silverfish, and rabbits. That's all we're leaving them with. Let's see what and we lost that one. One two zombie. Zombies. One oh two, two zombies, isn't it? Yeah, two. Yeah. That's right. Alright, yeah. anyway, thank you, you very much name, for the though? raid. Yeah, the guy up there. Oh, he's, he's, he's always been there, yeah. Yeah, he's always been there, and that guy's always been there. I've already checked their balance, they're not worth killing either or trying to kill. One has like sixty three dollars, one has seven hundred fifty. So they're definitely like contact clients. Right, anyway, oh, thank you very much for the invite to the raid. That Sorry. was actually pretty decent. Um, here, let's like share this out. I I want money from these, so look, take two, because I got most of the other spawners as well. So if you didn't watch yesterday's video, I built a secret head hunting base. What is that? It's basically a base where I only store player heads inside. Nothing else. Nothing else at all. No like spawners or anything. It's not a base. It's more just a place where I'm storing heads. I guess it's a base. And we have a fresh shipment of heads going in, and we also. Need to check if any of the player heads inside here currently have actually updated. But the goal is to hopefully, like, hopefully this won't get raided. But the goal is to, like, fill this up with heads and then, like, come on every day and, like, scan through all the chests and see if we can make monies 
monies, monies from people's heads. But let's just skim through all of these and see if any of these heads are going for a lot of money. Worthless, worthless, 120,000. That's been, that's, I think uh, that head, BSA Games, his head has been 120,000 for absolute ages now. It can, that can definitely go for more. I just need to wait. 9,000, worthless, worthless, 42K, 40K, 18, worthless, 59, I'm worthless. So, none of them are worth selling yet. If I was desperate for cash, I guess I would sell this head right here. But I know this head will definitely go for more in the future. I just have to wait. But the, the, the vision is that one day I'll come here, check a head, and it might sell for over like $1 million. Like, easy money, am I right? One day, one day, just as long as base doesn't get raided, which I say it will do. And if you want to know how much base work is being done, like a decent amount, we're not like, it's not done yet. But as you can see, we're making rev layers right now. Well, I will say this, Mikey is making rev layers right now. I think he was over here a second ago. He just, he just disappears, he just builds away. You don't actually see him build most of the time. There he is. Ah, uh, dude, he's a derpy snowman. <laughs> but at the moment, we're making rev layers and then we're building the actual obsidian wall right here which the whole faction has been advised like get ready we're gonna build this all in one sitting but we're definitely going to have to cover the roof here because apparently we keep getting jumped and you know i mean we're used to it but you don't really want to be building a wall and just continuously getting jumped because you'll never get it done like you know we can't gen these walls in they're gonna have to be hand places Is anyone here right now because if they don't have a chicken basket i could just knock them straight down and kill them there was someone here a few minutes ago hello is anyone here? I love how I'm looking for PvP and I'm not even properly geared. Like, I could just get wrecked. I don't know what I'm doing right now. So I know I've said this before, but I just want to give you an update. People are still attempting to raid this. And I wouldn't even call it attempting to raid. I guess just attempting to cannon absolutely fin. Like, they're attempting to raid fin air, basically. There has been a few people who have just been splitting walls. And are probably just splitting the walls just for a bit of fun. Which, you know, I mean, splitting walls are fun, but... Would you not wait till our base is up? <laughs> but then again, they're probably like, when will this base ever be up? It's been like three weeks now. It's never going to be here. Maybe it's just a big distraction. <laughs> but there's actually people trying to raid. What is this? What a waste of TNT. And time. <laughs> but look, we'll let them be them. You know what I mean? They do what they want to do. It's a free world. But anyway, guys, our next adventure, which is in tomorrow's video lies within here can you take a guess what it's going to be i'll give you a clue it's a raid but can you guess what kind of raid i don't know but anyway guys that is all for this video i will see you tomorrow for an insane raid see you then